Yeah, so we're here with Don Charles at the York Hall. Um, Chris uh, just uh, thought he got a good win. Um, what do you make of that? Yeah, I mean, um, he got the win. That's the main thing because, um, as you can, um, as you know, he's uh, he's lost his last three fights. He can contest some of those losses, but nevertheless, he reads a loss on his um, record. And um, to get a win tonight was the most important thing. And um, he outclassed his opponent, a very dangerous and durable opponent. Um, you know, yeah, he got the win. And with that win, um, when are you looking to get him out next again? As soon as possible, you know. Um, as you know, that's the second fight he's had under my tutelage. And we want to get him moving on. Christopher is a championship fighter, he really is. He's got skills in abundance. He's a very disciplined athlete. And we aim to uh, move him on. And we need him to get back into title uh, fights. That's the objective. And um, you're going to be moving gym uh, in a couple of days' time. Uh, what is this new gym? How is this new gym going to be different from the old gym? Well, basically, we, we're currently where we're situated um, in Finch Central. We've been there for the last 10 years. It's kind of sad to, to, to move from there, but you know, you, you outgrow things in life. We've outgrown that space, and um, but that space will always be um, it's personal for me because it's my first space as a coach, and a lot of good things have happened in that space. We've trained quite a lot of champions in all different weight categories, namely Derek Sora, and um, so that space means a lot to us, um, to the team. And um, but we're relocating to another good home, about two, approximately two miles from where we're presently uh, situated, so um, I'm looking forward to it, new beginning. And you mentioned Derek Chisora there, he fought last week and won, or Tyson Fury fought last week and won, uh, what's next for Derek, who's uh, the next event going to be before that possible Tyson Fury? Well we're, we're having a meeting with uh, our promoter Frank Warren um, next week, and Frank knows best, you know, we trust him, he's guided us to where we've gotten today, and we have every faith in him. We have faith in God first and foremost, then secondly in Frank Warren. He knows what he's doing and we, if he thinks we should uh, fight before the Tyson Fury fight, um, then so be it. We're ready and willing and able. Um, if he wants us to wait and uh, fight Fury when Fury is ready, we will always be ready. A week, looking back a week on, uh, what did you make of both Derek's performance and Tyson's performance last week? Yeah, I mean, the m most uh, we can ask for is for a win. Um, taking Johnson, Kevin Johnson, it was a very risky fight to, to have taken, you know. Um, it wouldn't, he wouldn't have been, Johnson wouldn't have been my first choice opponent. Uh, but nevertheless, we're in the business of entertainment. So therefore, you have to respect Derek, myself, and the promoter Frank Warren, because it was a massive uh, risk to fight such an opponent who, you know, this guy has been in with everyone and he always manages to take people uh, the distance and he always is very durable, he's, very, uh, he's got a lot of tricks. And um, I was um, very pleased with the win. Also pleased in the way Derek um, kept his patience, didn't get tricked into uh, doing anything silly. Uh, he had to keep total concentration was the key. What did you make of Tyson Fury's performance last week and do you think uh, with the rematch um, yourself and Derek have learned from the last loss to Tyson Fury? Most definitely. You always learn from your mistakes in life, you know, especially us. Um, Fury performed as well as he could. Um, you know, as you know, he's, he's had a big disappointment when David Hay pulled out twice, not once, twice. And I'm not a hypocrite. I do feel for Tyson. The fact that I would have thought he'd be quite in depression, hence why you saw the condition he came in. He wasn't in very good condition, but you've got to take, give credit to him he was not in a very good condition, he still grinded at a very good win. It was a very good win against a very durable, credible opponent. So it makes it all, you know, all lined up for, uh, for, for a possible rematch uh, with um, uh, Fury and Chisora.